Hey yo, thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source, your source for celeb news. Now today we have, hey yo man, we got, yo, we got WAP 100 talking about how long takashi has got left. You know what I'm saying? I mean like on the earth. You know what I mean? E-A-R-F. Okay. Uh, we also got, um, uh, J, uh, yo man, we got a, we got another artist. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I mean? Catch, catching the, catching a hot one. All right. Um, uh, we got the baby man. What, what went down with him? Uh, we got some uh, other other folks that have lost their lives, man, due to the nonsense, man. And we got Glorilla again. Thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source Show. If this your first time to the channel, man, be sure to hit that like button if you feel any part of the content. We definitely appreciate that. Hey, yo, that notification bell is waiting for your tap. So go on and give it a tap. And the subscribe button is waiting for your subscription, man. So go on and touch that, too. All right, let's set this one off with Glorilla real quick, man. You know what I'm saying? I, got, I don't got all day, man. I got a meeting to go to, man. You know what it is, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I don't know why they set meetings on Sundays, neither. Check this out, man. Glorilla made an interesting statement. Now, last time I think I covered a uh, Glorilla story, right? It was her explaining how she did not believe, like she was shocked, right? That foxes were real. It was incredible. She was like, wait a minute, them things is real? And the lady was like, yeah, 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 we got foxes out here. And she was like, no, no, no. You mean like in real life, like them things are actual, they're not just fake? And the lady was just like explaining it very patiently. She, she had the patience of a school teacher, of a special ed school teacher. You see what I'm saying? She was breaking it down like, no, no, foxes are real. They're a real thing. You know what I'm saying? She was talking about foxes like they was from another planet, though, man. Now, Glorilla has explained something else that she found absolutely astonishing. She posted. I, 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 the more she posts posts like this, I like her more and more. In fact, I was just listening to the song that she had with him, Cardi B. I forgot the name of the song, man. And I was like, I don't really like her voice. And I'm not a big fan of her flow, right? Like, I don't like her work. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, cause you know, you might not like my work, but I like her in particular. So I like her, but I just don't like her work. So call, you know, call me what you want. I don't really care. Yeah, you know I mean, you might like me and hate the work I do. You might look at my my paperwork and be like, this joint is trash. Whatever. Yeah, you know what I mean, as, as long as you like me. Yeah. You know I mean? Anyway, my bad. Glorilla said, "Quote: I know y'all gonna laugh at me and call me slow and ish." Right? Poor girl. Like, why why you why are you even starting off like this? Don't even suggest it, sis. I know y'all gonna laugh at me. We're not. And you gonna call me slow and ish. You'd be surprised how many slow people out there glow. She said, but I'ma admit it first. And still say yo mama. But anyways, I haven't eaten any pork for almost five months now. Tell me why I just found out ham is pork. Close quote. Open it back up. Open Open the quote back up. I'm not done. She said, I don't know what the F I'm going to eat for Thanksgiving now. <laughs> Close the quote. Close the quote. All this time, she thought she ain't eat pork in five months and every Thanksgiving. She been eating ham like she been eating ham incessantly. Yes, that white meat that you're eating, sis, that's pork. Ain't it, ain't it tasty, man? Ain't it incredible? Matter of fact, <laughs> I'm going to show you. Um, I hope I still got the video. I had a, I saw a video the other day, man. Let me see if I still got this joint. All right, I couldn't find it, but I found an alternative. Look at this video right here. Source, can you play the video, man? I'll just talk right over it, man. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't need to hear the... Matter of fact, take a look. Take a look. Real. Tell me, tell me, look at you salivating. You, you don't find that nasty? You like, oh my gosh, I want some pork rice right now. You're, you're disgusting. But I, I low key think I want some pork rice too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> look, the only white meat I'll put in my mouth. Hey, yo, check this out, man. You like, yo, yo, yo. Pour. So you gotta say pork. So you gotta say pork. Come on, man. I ain't. Come on, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I shouldn't even have to. Anyway, um, uh, look, I was speaking with my people yesterday, right? And they was like, yo, I wonder what little Dirk is doing, man. We ain't heard from him in a minute. <laughs> they was like, I hope Dirk is behaving himself. Last I heard, he broke up. I was like, yo, last I heard, he broke up with his lady, India. You know what I'm saying? I think she was a good influence on dude. You know what I mean? I, I was trying to tell my people, like, yeah, India was busting at the ass with that man. That's a good woman right there. You know what I mean? They was like, uh, <laughs> a good woman don't slide with her, man. I was like, she ain't slide. The ops broke into the house. And she wasn't cowering in the corner screaming, giving up the location in the house to the ops. 
she was bossing at them. You see what I'm saying? Defending the palace. Yeah, you know I mean, she belonged in the movie 300. Look, talk about a help me. Now, the convo turned to how Dirk has had a lot of people connected to him pass away. You know what I'm saying? And in a sense, as like a Chicago artist, for the time he's been in the game, the man is kind of a legend. You know what I mean? Like, his cousin OTF Nunu, murdered. OTF Chino Dollar, his uh, friend and uh, manager, murdered. Close friend King Vaughn, mur uh, murdered. His brother D Thang, you know what I'm saying? A calamity struck again. You know what it is. You know what I mean? I mean, like, what this man's eyes have seen. It's a miracle he is not absolutely stark crazy. You see what I'm saying? And now, two men affiliated with Lil Durk, KD and, uh, what is it, Lamron Kwan, they got into an argument on Saturday morning, and the two killed each other in North Dakota. I know some of y'all are like, North Dakota? Don't miss the point. You know what I'm saying? The fact that they killed each other is insane. You know what I mean? It almost makes it, like... <laughs> that's crazy that's like they had a it, it was stated that they had an argument and i guess they started shooting at each other and both of them hit you know what i mean i mean talk about karma right you're like damn i know look prayers up for their families man i'm assuming the two may have hit each other with the searing hot metal and um <laughs> i look i heard somebody say that's a real nigga moment right there tell me about it man look 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 look, look, look i look <sighs> i mean i think guns in the i like i understand guns in the hands of responsible people is maybe necessary right <laughs> but that freedom of of the second amendment possessing firearms ain't it beginning to look more and more like the country's curse you see what i'm saying like we cursed with it anyway um uh look, 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 we reported to you a while back right that, um they were selling tickets for, uh, to see the baby on some two for one type sale prices right folks tried to say the man fell off and he and he even made light of that statement now there's a cheesecake factory worker in nashville that has stated that the baby kept coming in trying to give away tickets to um his show but her co-workers kept turning him down Folks have been all over Twitter trying to post up memes of how people have been declining the man's invitation. One person posted, quote, the baby saying he can compete with Kendrick Lamar and J. Cole while giving out free tickets to his concerts is crazy. Another person said, watch out, y'all. The baby broke into my house and forced me to accept t a ticket to a concert. Another person posted, quote, be careful out there, everyone. I had zero the baby concert tickets in my car and someone broke in and left 10 more. Close quote. You see, you see why we can't like this is why I don't think like the aliens, they don't even they they don't want to come here. They shouldn't. I don't think they want to come here because if they see the foolishness that we be doing, you know, what I mean, someone else posted, quote, the baby literally dropped off 100 tickets at my mom's job and they've been sitting at the front desk for two weeks. All 100. Close quote. And lastly, right. Someone posted. The way the baby's life going right now, I wouldn't be surprised if this issue is real. With a pic that read, <laughs> why they playing with this man? <laughs> now, the pic, um, <laughs> what's the pic say? Let me see if I can get the pic up because I, I, I had it. Okay, the pic goes, yo, it's the baby and I'm in your city. My car broke down. I need $125 to make it to, to my show. You got me? I'll get you and your friends in for free. Let's go. <laughs> and it goes, then it goes, please, bro. I don't know. Look, I don't know why they messing with that man. You know what I'm saying? Like, why they playing with this man? This is the same dude that made the 911 call like, uh, y'all please come get this man. I pop. You know what I'm saying? He knew he shouldn't have been in here. You know what I mean? And you, you can hear the dude screaming in the background. He like, shh, shh. I can't hear the operator. You know what I'm saying? Look, remember when that man popped the dude in the leg and said, I could have killed you, but I popped you in the leg because I move righteous. I said, damn. You know what I'm saying? I said, God. Lee. You know what I'm saying? This dude different right here. Now, um, uh, academics did post a show featuring the baby um in Atlanta saying whoever uh and and the and the um post says whoever's paying the blogs to post that bullish need to get their money back. <laughs> I ain't working. I ain't um that's what it says. That's what it says. That's what it says. You know what I'm saying? Uh, is it time for me to do my shout outs, man? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me, let me do my shout outs real quick because I got to make it to this meeting in the next five minutes, man. I can't be late. It's going to be a short video today, man. You know what I'm saying? you like, man, you say that all the time. Yeah, but I'm, I mean that ish. Today, I mean it. I mean it. You know what I mean? Uh, kicking it with Lisa said, yo, I believe that I'm glad my, oh, okay, because she was on the backup channel. I appreciate you supporting the backup channel, by the way. Y'all know the backup channel, man, celebs sauce um it said i believe that i'm glad my son is in prison 
he was a terrible person on these streets. That's what kicking it with Lisa said, man. I said, damn, shout out to her objectivity, man. She knows without a shadow of a doubt, like, yeah, my seed is, you know what I'm saying? This is a bad one. This is like a, this was a weed that popped up. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I mean, like, and it, I, you, I can't imagine the pain that she felt feeling like she, like she had, like saying that, you know what I mean? You're like, can you get your sentence out? Yo, man, please get off my back, all right? The ghost 82 came through and said, yo, you're not lying. As soon as I have my first son, uh, this is on the blue face thing. Because remember, um, we posted a video with blue face's mom on a backup channel, man. And where she was basically saying, like, I'm not even paying the bail money like that. Don't come to me for no bail money. We the ones that what, that fronted, fronted the money for the Tatiana. You know what I'm saying? The go and I was like, essentially saying prison saves a lot of people's lives, believe it or not. The ghost said, yo, you're not lying. As soon as I had my first son, I stopped dealing with the streets and never went back to jail. And now my daughter has me cleaning up my credit and planning for the future. And it all started with one too many trips to prison. Hey, yo, that's heavy stuff right there, man. Yo, shout out to children, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't look, look, I'm going to tell y'all right now, man. If you can help it, man, don't abort these kids. The, the, the children are more of a blessing than you know. You know what I'm saying? The scriptures teach that children are a blessing. You like, well, what about the last shout out you read? Hey, yo, man, come on, bro. You know what I'm saying? I didn't say it was law. It's a principle. No, no, no. Children, children are largely a blessing in your life. You know what I mean? I mean, sometimes, you know, things can go crazy, but uh, be also be careful who you make the children with, too. You know what I'm saying? Don't be like, don't be locking up with the wrong people that are wilding out and then be like, oh, I don't understand how, how it's going this way. You know how this is going this way. You know what I'm saying? Um, how can I sp help speak on this? Said celebs, you the man, bro. Keep speaking the good words, as you know words matter. Love from Canada, man. May God, uh, may God continue to bless the words coming out of your mouth. Um, yo, we appreciate that. Uh, speak on this, man. I, that really means a lot, man. I pray, yo. I be praying some, like a lot of times. I be trying to pray before this. You know what I'm saying? I be, I be asking the Lord, like Lord, can you, um, you know what I'm saying, help me to deliver this effectively, and help me to spread the message that I need to spread, man. You know what I mean? Because I can't really, I don't, I can't see a lot of y'all face to face to face, but I can impart, you know, knowledge to you that can trans potentially transform your life. You know what I mean? So, yo, man, hopefully y'all praying that prayer with me that the Lord will use your boy. You know what I mean? And lastly, Heavenly Lonnie came through and said, Saleh, I've been watching you for a while now, and I can say you is by far the most funniest. Nah, 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 come on, sis. Don't, don't, you know, stop flattering me. She said, down to earth YouTuber on this mother effing joint. P.S. Um, P.S. is an option to, like, both songs. Oh, damn, I ain't counting the tallies. I can't give you the tally today. I gotta do it tomorrow. I gotta count it up tomorrow. I'm gonna let you know what won them all. Between Third Eye and um, uh, Third Eye and what's the other song that was on there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was um, Control. You know what I'm saying? For money. Between those two songs, yo. Be sure to um, stick your, continue to put plug your votes in, man. We're gonna tally it up tomorrow, man. Because we're gonna have time tomorrow. Today I've been rushing, man. I had to go to church. You know what I'm saying? Um, you like, yo, what, what, the, what, the, what the pastor speak on, man? Yo, man, you like, it was for me. You know what I mean? You got to go to church for you. <laughs> you like, you just don't remember. Yeah, you're right. Check this out. Uh, keep it up with the cur accursed trend of rap artists flashing their wealth and getting clapped and robbed. Another artist has been the unfortunate victim of the bull-ish, okay? Rapper J Money was in Koreatown yesterday. Um, Money was moving through in the Rolls Royce Phantom in LA. Mistake number one, okay? The vehicle was registered to uh, uh, Andrew Lee, the crown prince of the imperial family of Korea. you like, wait, is he really connected to the crown prince? Of I don't know, man. You know what I'm Maybe. Look, who ain't connected to the crown, crown prince of uh, Korea, of the imperial family, man? Don't tell me you don't know. Anyway, uh, Andrew Lee dropped the track with Jay Money. Jay Money got stuck for his rolly and his gold chains. <laughs> you would think being connected to the crown prince would have made a difference. But alas, a hungry wolf don't give a cuff about who you know. He just want to eat. You know what I'm saying? And a rapper walking through the wilderness wearing a chain around his neck made of smoked ribs and a wrist covered in lemon pepper wings is just begging for an encounter with a wolf. Here's the thing, man. What you got away with yesterday does not guarantee that you're going to get away with it today. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know, I understand rappers been doing that. Hey, look, I got a lot of wealth. I'm flashy. I'm flashy. Look at me. I mean, you like you can still do that now. Just don't be surprised, you know what I'm saying, when, when things go left, man. Like, we have to consider the time change, man. You know what I'm saying? You set your secondhand clock back a couple of weeks ago, didn't you? When the seasons change, you don't dress accordingly? What you may have been able to do in all locations um, back in the days, you know what I'm saying, flashing all your wealth and jewelry, all that might be coming to an end. You know what I mean? And I'm saying if you could avoid it, 
You know what I mean? Cause, cause look, your iced out chain ain't really convincing anyone anyway, man. You know what I mean? <laughs> you like, sure it is. The armed robbers. Oh yeah, that's right. You know what I mean? Look, they are fully convinced of your wealth. Look, if I was a rapper and I had to, I'd get a light chain and heavy security. You know what I'm saying? And, and return to the crib with fat pockets. And finally, Yo, it's four o'clock where I'm at, so I gotta wrap this up so I can get to my meeting, man. You know what I'm saying? You like who you meeting with, man? I'm meeting um, with some folks internationally. You know what I mean? Some folks from, from you know what I mean? The uh, Germany, the Germany this time. All right, look, 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 look. We done, we done told you the other day. Your favorite artist, Takashi Six Nine, is back outside, antagonizing anyone that tunes into his vids. He dropped the song STD, and in the video, he's kissing about five women on the mouth in the in the same sitting, and damn near handing out Birkin bags to everybody. You know what I'm saying? Which tells me. Some folks will do anything for attention, and it also tells me a lot of people are a lot dirtier than they look. You know what I mean? Wack 100 has um, come out uh, per personally stating that he don't think Takashi is going to make it to Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Moving in the manner that he's moving. You know what I mean? Hey, yo, take a listen. You know what I'm saying? It's them and it's us, bro. Look, we pulled over right here. We finna go in. Wack, what's that spot you like to eat at? Amy Roos. Go to Amy Roos on the hundred. I watched him go to Amy Roos 116. Get out there. The African sitting right there, two up right there. He talking to going in there, ordering his food, 15, 20. Well, like I've been here 15, 20 minutes, bro. They ain't running around looking for me. Trust me, bro. I didn't took about nine pictures, you see. The Muslim monsters across the street, they don't give about none of this anyway. He like, bro, they act like I'm some uh, wanted dead or alive. They can say, that's why I be like, yo, bro, every time you say it to me, either you're nobody or you don't come out or you just scared because I know what I see. Now, he putting it in his faces. So let's see. Now, bet not see Christmas. If he do, it bet not mention the six nine to me. He bet not see Christmas moving like that. I'm gonna be honest. That's why he already proved it to me. He he been oh, on. bro. This ain't nobody. He ain't the first one. Ain't gonna be the last. They'll change the game because I now I see that like gangs be talking, bro. Just be talking, and here go the cold part about it. I'm waiting for that interview he gonna do. He told me he gonna do it one day. He said I'm gonna shut the whole New York down. He said I ain't did it, whack, cause my city. I don't want him looking bad. He said. Now if I understood his point um, correctly, it sounds like he's saying um, he would be surprised if nothing happened to him in New York, seeing that he appears to be moving so recklessly, man. But here's the other thing, man. New York may not quite move like L.A. You know what I mean? Like, it seems like in L.A., like you post your location, hit send, and when you look up from your phone and out the car window, you staring down the barrel of a 9 millimeter with an extended clip and a switch. You know what I'm saying? Like, them dudes is not running on CP time over there. You know what I mean? If, on, look, if only they could apply for an honest wage somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, um, I do hope Wack 100 is wrong about that. Because, I mean, I may not love Takashi 69 as an entertainer. Like, I might not like his, you know what I'm saying? His, um, what's that? His TPS reports. I don't want the man dead. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's, that's like a real far stretch. Like, I never even met the man. Why would I personally want him dead? You know what I'm saying? You gotta be sick to not know him personally, but want him dead. Like that's like that's how that's how I know like our society is largely filled with sick people. Cause there are people that never met Takashi Six Nine, and they want him dead. They want his family dead. They want his house burnt to the ground. You know what I'm saying? They want the, like. <laughs> I'm like, yo, man, y'all, y'all, y'all got too much time on y'all hands, man. Y'all need to go touch the grass and freaking go to work. You know what I mean? Because come on, why would you? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, look, 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 look. I be wondering why um, a ninja would risk his freedom trying to kill this guy. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would you risk never seeing your peoples again to hurt someone who don't even know you exist? <laughs> That's just weird to me. Anyway, you'll let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Be sure to like. Be sure to subscribe. Be sure to check yesterday's vid because, um, you know what I'm saying, um, we had NBA Youngboy in a thumbnail, man. I think NBA Youngboy is shadow banned, honestly. Quite frankly, I think he's shadow banned. Every time we post NBA Youngboy, I mean, he's the most streamed artist for some reason. You would you would think when we put him in a thumbnail, the, 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 everyone will be looking it up. I'm honestly believing the man is shadow banned. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so be sure to check yesterday's vid and vote. Um, thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source. Your source for Celeb News.